by an off-duty Palm Beach County Sheriff's deputy. Good evening. I'm Tiffany Kenny. I'm Todd McDermott in the Breaking News Center. Thanks for joining us tonight. The Martin County Sheriff says the crime was an attempted sexual assault. The woman was running on US-1 near Osprey Street just before 7 o'clock tonight when the attacker allegedly pounced on her. Winnie Burbank is live in Martin County. Winnie, the suspect may also be tied to crimes in Palm Beach County. Todd, Martin County Sheriff William Snyder says this man is also wanted, as you noted, in Palm Beach County. I'm told he's still being questioned here right now, and he could walk out of that door right over there at any moment. Now, let's take a look at, look at this suspect. Now, this is 21 year old Stephen Gorgeous. Sheriff Snyder says around 7 p.m., Gorgeous was on his bicycle on Route 1 when he stopped, ditched his bike, and crossed the road to approach a woman who was jogging there. That's when Snyder says the suspect allegedly strangled her, but she fought back and was able to flag down a driver. But this driver turned out to be an off duty Palm Beach County Sheriff's deputy, who Snyder says apprehended this suspect. But in the end, Snyder says it was this woman who was courageously able to stop what could have been. A tragedy. When she said something clicked in her head, she said, I'm not going to be a victim. This is not happening to me. And she fought back hard. She was very brave. And in her fighting back, she's able to get loose. Her hair was matted, full of sand, full of hair. He had pounded her head into the ground uh, and tried to uh, sexually batter her. So if she'd have stayed there and complied, we could have had, you know, one of those tragedies that, that uh, the, the nightmare tragedy that keeps me awake at night. Now, that off duty deputy on his way to a 35th anniversary dinner with his wife, I'm told. But Snyder says he helped catch a man who is wanted, I'm told, on multiple counts of sexual assault and kidnapping in Palm Beach County as well. For now, we're live in Stewart, Wendy Burbank, WPBF 25 News.